Alan Levy is the leader of one of the few NIH-sponsored uh, Alzheimer's centers. And as such, he's one of uh, 29 or 30 national leaders that directs the national strategy for Alzheimer's research. I think that what's unique about Alan is that not only is he an excellent clinician who sees Alzheimer's patients on an almost daily basis, he's also a basic science researcher. And that type of combination is fairly unique in North America, if not in the world. My whole professional career has been one of uh, integrating both science and medicine. So I went through uh, an MD-PhD training program, and I've been committed to that path ever since I was a, a young student. I get inspired every day by the people I work with and the patients we get to have the great fortune to be involved in their care with. The first time I met him with my wife, Cecile, um, when we were going through the diagnostic phase, he exuded compassion from the word go. We knew we were in caring hands. He recognizes that his expertise is going towards helping families, not just solving a problem. Under Dr. Levy's direction, we're really changing the way we see Alzheimer's disease. Just 15 years ago or so, we saw Alzheimer's disease as a disease that will rob someone's ability to pay taxes, to manage finances, to make a meal, and so forth. Now we're thinking of Alzheimer's disease as a disease that occurs decades before the first symptom occurs. We have breakthroughs ahead in genetics, understanding the genetic underpinnings of devastating diseases like Alzheimer's disease. Uh, we have fantastic research developing new biomarkers, new tools that will allow us to um, diagnose these diseases in advance, even at asymptomatic stages. Since I've been at Emory, um, my entire clinical practice has been based at Wesley Woods. So our ability to take care of patients um, depends on not just having me as a doctor, it depends on having a social worker who can contribute and support families in ways that we need, a nurse practitioner in nursing to provide the team support, neuropsychologists to help us assess memory in detailed ways that we otherwise wouldn't be able to do, having colleagues in geriatrics who can provide the medical expertise and the psychiatric expertise when we need these so we can provide more of a holistic approach to our patient. And we can only do that through the support that we get from the foundation. Alan has committed his entire career at, to not just conducting his own um, really important research, but to promoting the development of an environment in which a lot of talented people can work effectively. And, and so by making that environment happen, by um, advancing his own research, by supporting the development of the success of others around him, Alan has absolutely gone a long way to uh, making sure that we reach the goal of establishing a cure for these horrible diseases. Alan, I couldn't think of a better person to honor tonight. You are a great man, you're a hard worker, you're a visionary, and I'm proud to be part of your virtual team. You hold the key to a cure, and uh, we hope to uh, see a cure for Alzheimer's disease under your leadership over the next uh, five years. Congratulations, Alan on a well-deserved um, award and recognition for your contributions. Um, I love you, Guy.